Spanish sporting company Homa has inked a five-year deal with the Trinidad and Tobago Football Association. It's all part of the reshaping of the association, which officials hope will bring success on and off the field. So what the new kit looks like, as modeled by several young footballers... Homer has been in the sports goods business since 1965 and they are in more than 70 countries worldwide. TTFA General Secretary Sheldon Phillips said it's the start of a new era. So today, July 1st, marks the beginning of a five-year partnership that will be essential in our quest to achieve international football relevance. The TTFA is excited to show Trinidad and Tobago what we can and will do and with that, we proudly present to the public our home of match casual and training kit line for 2013. President Raymond Timkey said the new kit is also a small part of the puzzle as the association looks to become self-sufficient. We are going to be self-sufficient. We have engaged for the first time in the history of football as far as I know. It, a marketing team that is dedicated exclusively for, for looking at, at uh, income streams and other uh, marketing initiatives, both within our country and of course it has for it spreads all over the place, all over the world. Phillips have thanked government for their recent support which came following the election of Tim Key as president. Today close to seven million dollars have been invested in TTFA programs since Mr. Tim Key's election, including a recent four million dollar investment in our Go Camp Cup campaign. And we ask a couple of young footballers about their impressions of the new uniforms. Feels good, the material is, is a good material. Oh, what about the logo? It's a brand new logo for the association. You like it? Yeah, it, it, it looks it look beautiful. The uniform is, is really good, really, really good. And um, best of all, the new logo is very, very, very good. And um, interesting about the uniform is that we don't have to wear the um, same thing as the men. Now they have the ladies cut in Joma, and which was really good, a good thing that added. So before you would have had to wear uh, a regular men's shirt? Yeah, regular men's shirt, regular boys' pants, which was quite uncomfortable. You know, ladies want a uniform a little tighter, a little um, smaller fit. So now it's, uh, it's a bit different, and I'm glad to wear Joe Man. It's a, it's a very good brand. Well, President Tim Key also announced today the formation of a governance committee. What they may discover uh, at the end of the exercise is that we did everything well, and it doesn't need to be interfered with as well as they would identify various areas in you know, financing practices, uh, the way we do our governance, and of course, the way, the way we have our structure.